Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Dallas Munda. Today we are here with another unboxing and first impressions video of the product I just bought off Amazon and that's new tripod with rotatable center column. It's from the company called Newer. It's the same company I bought my LED light kits. And I did the unboxing and first impressions video of that as well. Just make sure you check that out. I will add the link of the suggested videos here. So let's dive into the unboxing of this product. It looks around five, six pounds in the box. Let's cut it open. And here it is. So a nice bag. You can take it. The tripod, and I think it came with this too. I'm not sure what is this for. Okay. That's it. It's a nice bag. Let's take this out. So I think this small it can get when it's fully folded. So Let's open this. So this is the ball head. Wow. I mean right off the bat like I can tell like it's like heavy duty. It's, it feels really sturdy. So the primary reason I bought this tripod was because of its functionality of the rotatable center column. So we just started a new food channel and I needed a tripod which has like more functionality to take upside down shots that I can use on countertops. So I couldn't figure out how to rotate the center column but it took me a couple of minutes to finally figure it out. So how the center column rotates is you have to unscrew this. And this. And like rotate like this. And then you can set your camera right here and then you can like rotate. So you can use to make like, you can use this to fill upside down shots like this if you are cooking something. And it's like 360 panoramic view. So I will go over five things about this tripod. First is durability, second is a design, third is functionality, fourth is height adjustability, and fifth is price. Okay, so let's talk about the construction and durability of this. I mean, right off the bat, I can tell like it has a good construction. I mean, like it feels sturdy. It doesn't feel cheap at all. It has, it's, it's made of aluminum alloy. So it's not as light as carbon fiber ones. They have a rubber feet so it doesn't slip on slippery surfaces. All in all, it looks durable and, and stable to me. Okay, uh, talking about its design, it has a unique design. It has a rotatable center column. Unscrew this, pull this out all the way, and then see it comes on. 
and then it's rotatable 360 degrees so I think that's what they call uh, panorama shots so uh, you can also use this tripod to do the inverted shots for the close angle shots so it can be used for inverted shots The other thing of design I like about this tripod is the knobs. They have to adjust the height. These are really easy to use. You just unscrew the knobs a little bit and adjust your height. The other design of this tripod is it can be used as a monopod. So this side, I think this leg, it says detachable monopod. So I believe this leg thing is detachable. Here, this side can be used as the monopod itself so this ball heads come out and it goes there Okay, so the third thing I'm going to talk about this is the height adjustability and the load capacity of this tripod. So let's start with the how shortest it can get to. So and that's in the foldable mode. So in the folded form it gets to its shortest height and that's 24.4 inches. And now if I start opening, so how this knob works is you have to unscrew a little bit pull the leg out and tighten the knob back. So this is the max height it gets to when it's fully open and I think this is 75 inches and 191 centimeters. So let's talk about the price though. I paid 135 bucks for this. I've seen it fluctuate a little bit up and down on Amazon. I believe it's, it's a fair price. Well, I guess I'm happy with the functionality I'm getting if you are into panoramic shooting if you need a tripod to use in kitchen for cooking videos like I do so if you have a use case that you want to use a center column for uh, I believe it's a fair price I'm happy with my purchase so I will use the tripod for a couple of months and I will probably do another review thanks so this is the first time I was using this tripod with the center column open but because of the weight of the camera it was tipping over so that's why I had to use this 10 pound rice bag to stabilize this tripod so it doesn't tip over towards the camera. But then I soon realized that I can spread the legs of the camera like in this picture to distribute the weight evenly and then I didn't have to use the weights to stabilize the tripod. I hope this will be useful to some of you out there. If this video was helpful, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. Thank you. I will see you in the next one.